What is going on guys, Gabs here, and today I have a Hecarim gameplay, and this is a leftover from Earth Ultra Rapid Fire, uh, the game mode that got removed, uh, or um, disabled, and it's quite sad, so I decided to pick this uh, game and make a commentary over it, because Hecarim is one of the most OP champions on Earth, and I decided that you probably miss Earth, I miss Earth, everyone misses Earth. So you probably want to see some Earth, maybe. Uh, I'm gonna get the first blood there. And, uh, you know, as usual, you want to get a lot of movement speed on Hecarim. Um, you want to rush those, uh, what are those called? Boots of um, mobility? No? Those boots, they give you super much movement speed. Look at this rise. It's gonna turret die. What a stupid ass. I'm gonna get the second kill right there. And Nunu is kinda gonna be my support this game. Uh, I feel kinda bad for him because um, he dies a lot. He gives me some kills, but it's nice. He, he's kinda my support. Uh, so I'm getting those boots here and home guard. I'm gonna teleport in. I'm telling Nunu to go. I'm like, go, go, go. He flashes in with this E. I'm just gonna rush. I'm gonna leave him with Galio. Uh, I think he's gonna die. I'm gonna get Cassiopeia. And yeah, he's gonna die right there. But it's gonna lead me uh, to uh, where it's gonna make me get that kill. And I'm gonna get a second kill here on Galio. So, rushing a lot of movement speed. Home guard and those boots are great. And then you just wanna teleport to a turret and go bananas. Uh, I, ha I know I haven't been that consistent with my videos, uh, I haven't uploaded that much, but I'm gonna try to get back to it, uh, it's a lot because of school, you know, it's almost the end of the year, uh, this uh, school term, and we got a lot of national tests in Sweden, uh, which is something that the whole country does at the same time, it's basically a test in... Uh, three subjects I think or four actually in Swedish English math and then Spanish as well because I've picked Spanish and I fucking hate Spanish no I don't hate Spanish if my Spanish teacher sees this I don't hate Spanish but it's uh, it's just a little bit difficult <laughs> and I kind of I hope I get like a decent grade but I'm not gonna get more than a decent grade I I'm just happy if I don't know, I got a C, like in ninth grade, we go, I don't know, I'm not that, like, educated on uh, how different school system works in different countries, but I, in Sweden, we go from um, first class to ninth, and then we start high school for three years, uh, when we are 15, and in ninth grade, that's the last year of primary school, I got a C in Spanish. Which is totally undeserved. I have no idea how I got that C. I got a B on one little part of, uh, on the national test because there are three parts, I think, or sometimes four or two. Uh, but for example, in Swedish, we have speaking, uh, a speaking test, which I've completed. Uh, I held a speech about uh, gender about switching genders and gender equality or not gender equality but about switching genders basically uh, and I've done the reading and writing test on the on, of the national test as well uh, so you have reading speaking and uh, talking in Swedish and then in English you have reading speaking hearing and Reading, speaking, hearing. Did I say them all? Reading, reading, speaking, hearing, and writing. Yeah, writing. So that's four in English, which kind of sucks. And I haven't done any of them yet. Uh, so I've got a lot left. But what was I talking about? Yeah, I was talking about Spanish. Oh my God, I gotta keep to the subject. Um, but I got a C in Spanish because I got a B on the writing and I freaking suck at writing you know but you always get the same like the only thing I know in Spanish is writing like a letter about me that's the easiest thing because that's the first thing you learn to write a letter about yourself you know uh, 
tengo un hermano uh, and a bunch of bullshit like that that means I have a brother by the way uh, but you like it's really easy to write things about yourself because you have done it so much you know um, and I think we got that the last national test in ninth grade uh, so I got a B on that I honestly had no idea what to write like I didn't know what the freaking subject was I, I didn't understand because it, it was like an explanation in Spanish about what you were supposed to write about and I didn't understand what it said I had no idea uh, but my uh, teacher actually helped us a bit and explained it sort of I don't know if that was allowed but she kind of did and uh, I could finally write about something and I think I wrote about uh, my last vacation or something like that and I got a B I was seriously worried that I was gonna get an F I thought I was I wasn't gonna pass at all and I got a B it's insane I, I have no idea <laughs> so that was just luck I guess I don't know uh, but, but, but apparently I wrote a decent text and I got a C on the whole subject so I'm hoping that something like that will happen again probably not uh, but I just gotta pray to something I don't know I, I don't I'm not religious but I'm gonna pray anyway hope for the best uh, but I think my Swedish national test went pretty well and you can't really prepare yourself that much to them uh, it's a test as I said the whole country does it at the same time and you have no idea what it's about you, you get something like you get some guidelines we got like in Swedish we got a, a poem to read to just prepare ourselves kind of for the Swedish national test in reading uh, although that poem wasn't used for anything I didn't even read the poem uh, but I, I think I got a pretty decent uh, grade anyway I, I don't know yet but I think I got pretty good uh, I think it went pretty well and you can't really prepare yourself uh, to the national tests um, except in Spanish maybe because I don't know much about Spanish so I need to study a lot but uh, I just fucking hate it so much I don't oh it's so hard but you know in English I, I don't have to prepare because I'm pretty good in English I I hope I can get an A I got a B last year I hope I can get an A um, I just realized that I spent this whole video talking about freaking school which kinda sucks <laughs> but uh, whatever I hope you enjoyed this uh, commentary, um, wrecking some scrubs in Earth with Hecarim, you know, it's not hard, but it's fun, and that's all that matters. Play for fun. There's the end, victory for us. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Peace.